a soft raspberry pink makeup inspired by the Lunar New Year. All products will be listed in the description box. I've already washed my face and applied my skincare. The first step is to apply a light even layer foundation all over the face. This is my first time using a metal spatula. I actually really like it. Take your foundation brush and buff and blend. Now apply a lighter concealer in the middle of the face to brighten. Use a concealer that matches your skin tone for blemishes and hyperpigmentation. Now tap and blend that out. Don't swipe. It'll smear and ruin the foundation underneath. That also goes for color correctors if you use any. Now set the center of your face with powder. Remember to pat or tap, don't swipe. Now time to contour. You can also add or substitute bronzer in this step. Next, add blush for a flush of color. Now define the brows. Don't press too hard or your brows will look too harsh. Go darker from the middle to the end of the brows and go lighter at the front of the brows. Use the spoolie to soften the lines. Now onto the eyes. Wipe off excess oil on the eyelids and prime the eyes. Today's eyeshadow palette is the Pink Flash number 2. Take a fluffy blending brush and apply a light pink color all over the eyelids. Now take a smaller blending brush. Apply the red color on the outer corner of the eyes. And blend, blend, blend. With a clean finger, place a pink shimmer on the center. Use a brown gel pencil and line the eyes. I decided not to wing it out for this look. Now smudge it with an eyeliner brush. This will soften the harsh line. Line the outer third of the lower lash line. And repeat on the other eye. With the same eyeliner brush, apply the red color to the outer third of the lower lash line. Take the pink color and apply to the center. Put the pink shimmer on the inner corner. I decided to put some on the outside of the tear duct. This draws light to brighten the eyes. Take the brown eyeshadow and pat it on the top lash line. This will prevent the eyeliner from smudging. Hey, not bad. Even though it's not a winged eyeliner, it still looks good. Now curl the lashes and add mascara. My method is a bit different, but it works for me. If you want to see the full tutorial, I'll have it linked below. For falsies, I'm using Dope Beauty in the Sal Fairy Dust. Trim and apply glue to the lash band. Wait a few seconds to be sticky and place it on your top lash line. and repeat on the other eye. 
one side is droopy. I'm gonna curl it with the lash curler gently. And that's better. With a brown liquid liner, I'm drawing small strokes on the lower lash line because mine are barely visible. See the before and after? The second one looks better. Oh well, good enough for me. Now wipe off any foundation and lip balm off your lips. Use a red lipstick all over your lips. Carefully apply it. You can use a lip liner first, but I didn't feel like it. Apply the top first, press your lips together, and fill in the rest on the bottom. Step back and see if you need to clean up your lines. Use foundation or concealer to clean up. Clean lines makes a big difference. See how nice that looks now? Reminder when wearing a dark lip, check for teeth stains. Take your clean finger and make this pop in your mouth to get rid of excess product near your teeth. Let's check again. Yay, no more staining. Yay! Time to set the face. Let's put on our lucky outfit. Quick tip. If your top or dress is really tight over the head, you might want to wear it first before you decide to do your makeup. I'm just going to add a little bling and let down my hair. Hmm, should I wear a headband? Does that look okay? Or maybe I should put up my hair. I haven't done that in a while. Hmm, I mean... I look a little more sophisticated. I don't know what to do with my hair. I'm just gonna let it down again. If you watched till the end, thank you so, so much for being with me. I hope you have a safe, wonderful, and prosperous new year. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to give me a big, big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell. I'll see you in my next one. Bye!